So we've been doing all these complicated slope application problems. Here's a nice little example of a simple one. Yay, way to backtrack to the easy. So problem says, what is the slope of the line y equals negative 2x? And clearly, I've been asked to find slope. And what have I been given here? Well, I've been given the equation of a line. One of the big tip-offs here that this is the equation of a line is that um, you can see it's actually written in slope-intercept form of a line. Um, and you might say, Kate, I have no idea what you're talking about. What is the slope-intercept form of a line? Basically, anything that can be written in this form, y equals mx plus b is written in the slope-intercept form of a line, meaning that you have some y that's sitting alone on one side of the equal sign, and then you have some number of x's plus b, and b is a constant, a plain old number. Constant is just a number that's by itself. It's not multiplying by any number of x's or y's or anything like that. So that's this idea, why this is a y equals mx plus b. Now, students tell me all the time, Kate, this is not in that form, because look, here's my y. They say, okay, I see my y, and I see my equals, and I see my m, negative 2, and my x, but they say there's no b. There's no constant. And that just means that my constant is 0. Another way to think of this line is y equals negative 2x plus zero. There is no constant, and that's okay. The constant can be zero. That's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. This is still an equation of a line. So knowing that, if you understand that about the slope-intercept form, it's super easy to find slope. Really, it's the easiest way. That's why mathematicians like this form so much. They like y by itself, because once y is by itself, they can just see the m and the b. And remember that M is the letter that we use to stand for slope. And you're probably thinking, why do we do that? Why do we use the letter M for slope? Um, I Googled it one day. It's actually because of the French word monter, which means to climb. Remember, your slope is how fast your line, line is climbing. Okay, so basically whatever number is multiplying with x is your slope. So what's the slope of this line? The slope of this line, and I'm too, being too lazy to spell. I'm a mathematician. I don't spell out words. So I'm saying the slope m is negative 2. And I wrote that in a complete math sentence, and I'm done. The slope is negative 2.